probably more of a hybrid, but in some instances, I think that you're the elected official and you have to take a stance. I'm using healthcare as merely as an example. There will be others. There are other instances where that has to happen. That was a bit fuzzy, but I hope you understood more clearly what I was saying. This is a non-policy question. Explain the resistance you've received from the party and others who don't want you to challenge Holden. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, that's pretty fraught. Okay. <laughs> I will. Um, I will do so diplomatically. And after this election, I will do so less diplomatically. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a Democrat. I have worked for the party for a very long time, since I was a very young girl. When I was a youngster, I would register voters. I worked to elect individuals into public office. I have spoken to my representatives about issues that I think are important to me and my community. I have supported individuals, even if they did not support issues and ideas and concepts that I held uh, 100%. I am a person who has given time, my talent, and, and my treasure. I've given money to candidates, and I've spoken about that. I am shocked and appalled. As I said, that's being diplomatic. I am shocked and appalled at the manner in which our party, it's not me, not the way they treated me. I'm fine. I'm the candidate. I'm tough. For tough, as someone said. <laughs> but it is the ordinary citizen who decides that they want to support someone other than the incumbent, other than the person who might be the designee, the party designated individual for an office. To me, that cuts directly against democratic principles and democracy. And I find that offensive. I think we need to get better. And I will talk to people about that. I've, I've talked about it before. I tend to be a talker, so I will continue to talk about it. If we don't get better, people will not run for office. Ordinary people need to be able to step up and run for office, to stand for office. When you deny individuals that right, or deny individuals the opportunity to support the candidate of his or her choice, then you undermine democracy. And that is wrong. And we, we need to speak out against that. And I will.